Goods in a traditional linear economy are designed to be used and discarded when no longer useful, despite the potential for refurbishing for recycling and reuse. In the fast fashion industry, garments are produced without longevity in mind, with 85% of textiles discarded into landfill. Often workers in developing nations, mostly uneducated young girls and women, are forced to work in inhumane labour conditions, in factories operating without sanitation, lighting or ventilation. Cotton, a monocrop, is the material of choice among manufacturers, with 10,000 litres of water needed to grow the one kilo of cotton necessary for a pair of jeans. As consumer technology becomes obsolete, Minerals and metals in our devices, such as phones and laptops, are discarded. The careless disposal of this e-waste drives demand for the mining of new resources where considerable human rights violations and abuses have occurred. So what is the alternative? Enter the regenerative economy. Think about consumption in a circular way, focusing on the efficient use and reuse of finite resources. The regenerative economy is based on three principles. The elimination of waste and pollution, circulation of products and materials at their highest value, and the regeneration of nature. Akin to biomimicry, it is a resilient system, good for the economy, society, and the planet. There are several steps we can all take to create a more thrivable world, including shopping at vintage second-hand or thrift stores, buying and using as many eco-friendly and biodegradable products as you can, adopting a more earth-friendly diet, reduce, reuse and recycle, boycotting products that endanger wildlife, not buying bottled water, and being water wise. To immerse yourself in sustainable actions, you should support businesses that employ anti-slavery practices and implement sustainable, regenerative principles. Raise awareness in your community. The systemic holistic model offers a shift towards thrivability by engaging a values-based innovative stance and employing a transdisciplinary systems thinking approach, thereby guiding economies from linear to regenerative. Transitioning from a linear to a regenerative economy is one of Thrive Framework's 12 foundational focus factors. It is a credible, measurable and implementable transformation mechanism that addresses the current crisis, pushing us beyond sustainability and towards thrivability, thereby ensuring that present and future generations can enjoy a sustainable society and a thrivable future. <laughs>